What's up guys, I've been hearing some pretty awesome things about the Nautilus, so I couldn't resist buying one. I've also got the Nautilus Mini, and today I'm going to review them both and let you know what I think. So first, let's take a look inside the box. Inside we've got the tank itself, we've got a coil, a thread cover, and we've also got a set of instructions. Inside the Mini, you've got pretty much the exact same thing, except for the fact that the tank is smaller. On first impressions, it's well packaged, it looks well made, it feels sturdy. Now one of the biggest things about the Nautilus that makes it different from so many other clearamizers on the market is that this tank has adjustable airflow and what this means is that we can adjust our airflow and by adjusting our airflow we can have more control over things like throat heat, taste and vapour production. And to change our airflow we simply turn this little ring at the bottom here and if you look closely you'll be able to see that every time we turn this ring around you get a different sized air hole. In total there are four different airflow settings on the Nautilus and if we want more vapour then we can increase our airflow or if we want a tighter draw then we can decrease it. Now that all sounds well and good in theory right but does this thing actually perform well in practice too? Hell yeah it does, because this thing tastes amazing. I've been using this device for a few days now and I can honestly say I'm getting some of the best tastes out of my juices that I've gotten off any device I've ever used. The throat hit is nice and strong, it's not harsh, and what I've been finding is that this level of control that you have with the adjustable airflow is not only great for suiting your mood, but I've been finding that certain juices just really pop at certain airflow levels. The Nautilus also has one of the largest tank capacities I've ever seen. It is huge with five mils of juice. I mean, when you fill this up, it just lasts forever. That being said though, it also makes the Nautilus pretty damn big. And whilst it looks really great attached to big devices like this, it does look a little bit silly on smaller batteries. And that's why I like the Mini because it is small and portable, but it's also got the adjustable airflow. On top of all of that though, this thing is just built really, really well. When you're assembling the parts and putting them together, you can just see how well it fits together. And I've literally experienced absolutely zero flooding or gurgling yet with this device but yeah I'm really am loving the flavor that I get off this and I definitely recommend either the mini or the regular to anyone that's looking to up their vape game and looking for a clearamizer that's maybe a step above the rest now as always if you'd like to pick yourself up either a Nautilus or a Nautilus mini then you can click here to check out my blog post about these devices where I put up links to the cheapest places to buy real authentic Nautilus tanks online. And as always, don't forget that you can click here to subscribe to my channel for more vaping guides and reviews in the future. Stay cool and keep vaping.